Yes, the title is correct. I did end up damaging my 2021 Tesla Model 3. I picked my Tesla up on December 21st of 2020. And 18 days later, uh, when I was shooting a video dealing with Summon, it happened. It wasn't the car's fault, it was my fault. It's n not that big of a deal. What ended up happening was after it summoned and came to me um, in one of those videos, it was a little close to the concrete divider um, when I was in the park. So I knew in my head that, that, that it was close, but I did not. I'll show you in the video. I do currently have it at a paint and body shop right now getting it fixed up. I dropped it off on February the 2nd. Um, I wanted to like take the time and see if it was feasible for me to do it. Um, it's just a car, so I'm okay. <laughs> it sucks, but it just lets me know that it's a car, so you can't be too uh, connected to it. I do miss it. I do not like driving a rental car. Um, ice car if you want to call it it is what it is i'll get my car back shortly uh, they'll have it a little over a week um, to make sure everything is good so there was no damage to the battery or anything like that so don't freak out on me uh, but that's it um, i just wanted to make a quick video probably at the uh, end of this video you'll probably see maybe me recording picking it up maybe so this video has been probably a week and a half in the making. So I just wanted to update everybody on that. You can barely see it, but I had to get it fixed, right? <laughs> All right. One eternity later. I'm gonna pick up my car. So I got the car. I'll show you how it looks. This is YouTube Ken. I'll see you in the next video.